travelled to Goering headquarters today to meet up with Paul, who's been with Steve Brown from ETG, a technical partner of Goering, and Paul has a special offer. Now, Paul, what are the special offers? What have you been discussing with Steve Brown? A uh, really interesting morning, actually. Before we talk about the special offers, I'm going to tell you a couple of things about this Nakamura AS200, which I've learned from Steve today. Uh, don't forget, you can comment on the MTD CNC website now by simply signing up for an account. Tell us what you think about the machines that we look at. Firstly, this, this Nakamura, um, when you look at this machine, obviously it's a multi, multi-axis multi machine. You've got two spindles here. You've got a single turret with, with driven tools, but you've also got the, the Y-axis here, which Goering have obviously capitalized on by machining this component here. You can't do milling like that on a turning center without having that, that Y-axis. But when we talk about Nakamura, they developed the AS range, which has been hugely popular for ETG. Uh, they developed it to have the, uh, the biggest working envelope within the smallest footprint so that ratio is essentially the best in the world you've got the biggest working envelope in the smallest footprint and we all know how engineers want to save on the space that a machine takes up not only that a couple of other things i learned about this machine every engineer hate doesn't want to have a collision so uh, and, if, and if this machine gets into a situation where there's a spike in the uh, in the software that basically shows that the, the machine is potentially about to have a collision or a tool's going to take in too deep a cut or it's about to hit the chuck, what will happen is the ball screw will reverse. It's a bit like an airbag, it's a safety mechanism, so it can, as a result of that, protect the machine against um, any issues with, uh, well, basically any crashes or any uh, hardware replacements that you might need as a result. Also, with this software, I mean, the, the, the smart software that you get with Nakamura now, this has got things like uh, it can actually talk to you. So the, the, the control can tell you how fast the feeds are and the speeds are on this system. It's, it's also got its own, um, its own monitoring software within the, the Smart X. Uh, and you can also have uh, cam software within here as well, which will give you verification. So there's all kinds of safety factors that have been put into this machine. And this machine is available from stock here. Goering have had it now for a few months. They've been using it and it's available for sale from ETG on a first serve. Uh, or first come first serve basis. Is there a price on that yet, Paul? Well, the Nakamura AS200 range um, depend on the model, but the, but the basic machines, or uh, a uh, what we'd class as I suppose as a, a multi-axis machine, start at a hun- under a hundred thousand. So you get a lot of capability for that kind of price. Now, one thing, Paul, for people that have not entered the arena of twin spindle y-axis with milling functionality and they may be a little bit frightened because they've not used that yet or that might be a bit too complex for them what would you actually say to that I think these machines, the, the manufacturers have overcome those kind of objections by making the controls very easy to use, very operator friendly. Even I could pick this up in a matter of hours really being able to program it. And once you, once you enter this arena, you start to talk about production. Um, Nakamura also have the fastest gantry loader in the world. There is no other gantry that is as fast as what you can get on a Nakamura. So if you are looking at reducing or improving throughput and getting parts off machines, Nakamura can offer you that, but not only uh, the fastest gantry in the world, also more simpler automation solutions where you've maybe got um, a system at the front of the machine where you manually put the parts in and then they'll then they'll automatically be put into the machine. That can be uh, part of, of what Nakamura can offer as well. I think the, the purpose of this exercise really, there's two machines we're going to look at, so don't go anywhere, the Quasar in a minute. But if you're interested in the AS machine, you want a, multi, a multi-axis multi machine, one hit machine, in the, typically like the parts you see in there from Goering that they're doing, then here's an opportunity to grab a, uh, grab a bar- bargain, really. Absolutely, Paul. And I think with a, a component like that, in the past, if you were looking to do it, you'd have done it on a lathe and on a milling machine. So you're even, you're even saving more foot, foot, footprint in your shop floor. Correct. It's all about these days, it's about uh, reducing the operator intervention and getting the parts off accurately. Second machine. Um, and don't forget, tell us what you think on MTD about what we're looking at here. This is a Quasar MV184 General Purpose Vertical Machining Centre. This machine is part of the rolling stock programme as well, equally like the Nakamura. So what happens with the technical academies is ECG will put machines in here and then after, after a few months or maybe six months or a year, they'll then sell these machines and put new machines in. That is how the academies work. And that's what we've got for sale today, this Quasar MV184 Vertical Machining Centre. This comes as a high, pretty high spec machine as well. It's got through spindle coolant, it's got coolant flood wash, it's got the Heidenhain control, swarf management system, a 30 station tool changer, and of course Quasar, what does it stand for, Gia? Quality, I believe. 
quality and service. And the MV184 is the entry level version. But this would come obviously with, with a warranty, with operator training and programmer training. And I think the purpose of this is to say that if you're looking at the moment for a machine turning, um, or milling, then here's an opportunity to get a deal on a couple of machines. Uh, you need to visit engetechgroup.com.